How are you guys doing today? It's me back again, Anthony Torado with AJTFX Learning. In today's video, I actually wanted to answer a question that I got. How do I analyze the markets when I'm looking to get into an entry or just looking at in general? How do you analyze the market in the foreign exchange, right? So before anything, before we dive into some great content, I make sure you're connected with us on Instagram, Snapchat, like our page on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, all at AJTFX Learning. And if you haven't visited our website at AJTFXLearning.com, you're definitely missing out on some great material that will help you become a profitable trader and take things to the next level. So as you guys already know, when you're looking to analyze the market, there's ideally two ways that we look as traders in regards to what may potentially happen within a currency pair. You know, look at the market is at a fundamental analysis level. And what a fundamental analysis level is based off of is when you're actually looking at the currency pairs and looking at what's happening economically, socially, politically in the country and what's happening in the news. You know, what's going on if they're making any governmental changes, if anything's happening in regards to wars. And as you can see, this is actually an example that you could find once you visit AJTFXLearning.com. You could go to your Forex tools, the news calendar, and it will appear something like this, where you will be able to see how, what type of an impact is that news going to make on the currency pair, what's actually happening, and exactly what time is it going to happen at. So when you are looking at your currency, when you are doing your markup, you can be aware that something may potentially be happening just because fundamentally this is going to be taking advantage because of the news event that's about to occur. Now, as you guys already know, when we dive into AJTFX learning, we're not looking at things at a fundamental level. We are aware of what's going on, but most of what we're actually looking at is based off of a technical analysis level. So when you actually look at a technical analysis level, what you're doing is you're actually basing things off of price. Whatever's happened in the past is potentially going to affect the future, right? So ideally, with different strategies and techniques that we're going to review within the learning course, for example, right here, we were able to identify support levels, resistance levels, Fibonacci levels where potential breakouts and entries can occur at. As you can see, we have our counter trend line from that downtrend that's occurring. We have the market that came up to the 61.8 and boom, crashing down, breaking our counter trend line, giving us a potential entry to profit off of, right? So ideally, by knowing different ways to analyze the market in the technical analysis level of things, we definitely could profit off of it not even have to worry as much as to what's going on in a fundamental level. You know, a lot of currency pairs out there, we're literally not going into each country, you know, doing our research. We're literally just looking at the price, being aware of what's happening in the news, and then just taking advantage of potential profit zones. So ideally, guys, those are the two ways that we're actually going to look at when we're analyzing the market, a fundamental level and a technical analysis level. But we are majority of the time looking at it at a technical analysis level. So this was me, Anthony Torado at AJTFX Learning. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this love this video. If you guys found some value, make sure to share, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next one. If you guys have any, any questions, feel free to connect with me. Definitely love helping other traders. So I'll see you guys on the next one.